Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Cargo Hub here in the Transport Fever 2. Today, we're over here looking at the sleepy town of Memphis. And what's going to be happening today is we're going to start building out our Memphis station because this is going to be a an interchange of sorts. Uh, we're going to be having three lines coming into the town. So we're going to have a Fort Lauderdale to Lakewood to Memphis line. We're also going to have an Austin to Irvine to Memphis line. And then out of Memphis, we'll have Memphis to Carlton to Elk Grove. So we have three lines coming in passenger-wise, and we also have our um, cargo line that'll be coming into here. So what we need to do is we're going to start by building our station here in Memphis. And just to kind of get some things started, let's. Uh, I think I'm going to put it over here on the edge of town right here so let's go ahead and get rid of this right we are playing and we do want to get our now yeah, let's go half speed yes we are playing there we go all right so the first thing we need to do is let's get our station in here and always the passenger stations i believe are always on the left is that what we're doing? Is that what we've been doing? Uh, here it's on the left. I'm going to check over here because I think I've been putting them all on the left. Yes, I have. Okay, so our passenger stations are all going to be on the left. And let's find Memphis again. I think that's it. Nope, that's not it. Wait, wait, what that was it? I don't know. Oh, they built it back. Let's pause and destroy that road again. And that way the AI does not build it back. So let's go ahead and get our our station going. No to this. Buildings. No. And currently we're doing 80 mitres. So let's get this guy flipped over here. Get him in there. And then we need three passenger stations and a cargo station. So uh, configure this guy up. So we need, we're going to put in another track. And we're going to put in a passenger platform, which is also going to need this. We have them over there, I believe. If not, well, sort of in now. Okay. And then we need another track. Because that can share that platform. And then we need the cargo track. And cargo buildings. You do our usual. And I know once we get everything situated as far as like the everything goes this this will change like this will be become a big bigger stations you know what i mean so let's go ahead and put in our lines out of here and then we can unpause the game so then the ai can do what ai do um i'm actually gonna bring them all out here they're not all going to go out like this, but this will help me as far as dealing with the AI, I think. Probably. Yep, we're good. Okay. So now we can unpause. And we're going to have two lines that go out this direction. And what they're going to do is one's going to go over here to Irvine and one's going to go to Lakewood. So, but we also will have our cargo line, which will split either way. We haven't figured out what the cargo lines are going to do. We'll get it. We'll get it figured out. You know what I mean? So let's get this 
I'm going to say the one on the left. Oh. Hold on. Because I forgot the high speed lines. So, and that's every six. So, I think one is coming into Carl's bad. So, one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so we're going to have... We'll have two high speed lines coming in here as well. Ooh. Okay, so we need two more passenger lines. Configure. Um... Mm -hmm. Okay, those are gone. Now we need platforms because we're going to need two more passenger lines. And then we're going to need platform. Let's see, those will be high speed lines. No, I only need. Two coming in, two coming in. Oh, we could put the high speed lines on one. Let's put the high speed lines on one terminal. So we'll have two coming in. And we will have the high speed line. And then we will have the exit line. Okay, so I don't need to do all of this. Oh, yeah, I did need that because I'll have. So we'll have two coming in, have the high speed line coming in and going out, and then we'll have the other line coming in. Okay, yes, there we go. Got it. All right. And then we will need another track for cargo only, cargo building, cargo platform. And cargo building. I probably did too much, but that's fine. Okay. Now let's get this guy out here straight. Nope. Do this. Now we can put this guy out here straight. And we can do this one. Okay, so here we will have a passenger line and a high speed line coming out. So these three lines will be going this way, so that means we can get rid of those lines. And then we'll have the high speed line coming out, and we only need to get rid of that line. Okay, so that's how it should look. And then this line will head basically straight. And then this one will head towards Irvine, which is going to be, I don't think I can see it from there. Okay, which is going to be kind of, if I put the high speed line in right here, I'm thinking in my head, it would have to cross over into there. And then this, either way it does, I guess it doesn't matter. I can, I'm going to put the high-speed line in the middle. So we're going to take this one out like this towards Irvine. And then we will also have the high-speed line. We'll, one will go like this. And one will go like this. And then we will have a cargo line coming like this. 
out here. I'm going to put it to say right there. Right there. So these will continue basically straight. And this one will peel off this way. Try to, is it going to let me do this? Okay. Let's get going out this way some. And let's start like right here. And then make sure we're connected at the end of the track. And then to right there. And we might have to shrink this a little bit because we're going to have to have the bridge over the water here. So, okay. We're going to build this bridge real fast. And that's going to be blue. I don't think I can raise that up at all, can I? I kind of want to make it a little bit... Let's go to right there. Just kind of make it look a little bit better. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to have boats in this anyway. Listen, I'm saying that now. But I, I'm not going to have boats in this, so... I don't think we have to worry about things going underneath the bridges. And if we do, we will we'll fix that later on. And then the Irvine one will come out this direction. I'm not going to go that far because... Yeah, we'll go up one. And blue. I was like, are we still playing? Is this st is it still going? I think we want to put this on one X. Because we should actually be like 19 something or other right now like we should probably be 1915 i think is where we should be so all right now let's figure out our signalage so we're gonna need here, we're going to do a little bit of magicalness. So what we're going to do is, when this guy is coming out. Oh no, I think we're going to do this up here. I was, I'll give you my reasoning in just a second. So basically what I was thinking was, is that I'll have this line cross over to here and then go this way. But um, I could still do that, but I don't, yeah, I'm going to keep the signals outside of this down to here because I think that would be better for train traffic and then this guy will need to go to right here signal one way yes this way and I'm going to put And then the same thing over here. I'm going to do this up here on the flat land and not in or not where it's curving. 
No curvature land. I'm still thinking about what I want to do as far as... So this guy needs to come out here like so. And then like so. I'm still thinking about what I want to do as far as the... Um, whatchamacallit goes, the, the cargo lines. And I'm not sure if I want to do a cargo deal that would be the same where it's just those three stops or if I'm putting, I don't know, we'll figure that part out later. So uh, the Memphis station for right now, except for, oh, we need to do the out direction on this guy. So let's get those going. They will need to go to Elk Grove. So we need to come out this way to Elk Grove. So then, again, I'm going to do this down here. Just because, well, I suppose, because uh, this, I suppose I could get this. We'll see what happens. Let's try it, like, right here. So this guy needs to come out over here. And this guy needs to come out over here. And that's very slow. Let's, um, let's kind of go like that. Sure. Sure, fantastic. Making them look even is what I was trying to do. All right, signals. One right here. And then one right here and one right there. All right. Well, the Memphis station is done. Let's put in the roads for all of this. The roads. Uh, I think I'm just going to cut it across here. I was thinking about putting in a bridge, but I'm not going to. If I were to, because that's going to be, okay, so yeah, we're going to put it in like right here. Kind of like that. I feel like that's straight. I don't know. going with it and then we can do the same down here where we go kind of like that and then across This just gives the AI the ability to build wherever, and they're like, oh, what? You build a road? We should also build a road, too. And I'm pretty sure that that is ugly looking right there. So 
That's less ugly? Sure. All right. So definitely there's our Memphis station. So that's done. And we're not going to be connecting this in because we don't have, <laughs> we haven't built all the rest of this stuff yet. Like we have to get Toledo to Elk Grove going. So let's check in on our Toledo station because the Toledo, I, I changed some things up. So the lines that we have to finish, here are the lines we have to finish. We have to go Fort Lauderdale to Lakewood to Memphis. We have to go Austin to Irvine to Memphis. And then we go Memphis to Carlton to Elk Grove. We also have Victorville to Huntsville to Lafayette. Lafayette to Elk Grove to Toledo. And then we have Toledo to Corona. So our only we I changed it up so our one there's just one line from Toledo to Corona. So that's just gonna be one passenger line. It's not gonna it's just gonna carry um, passengers from there to there. And so then Toledo will have one place coming in from Elk Grove. And Elk Grove will have Memphis and Lafayette coming into, or I'm sorry, Carlton and Lafayette. So this one will have two in, one from Carlton, one from Lafayette, and then the, that will go to Toledo. Ooh, a new boat, which we're not going to use. So that's going to be the, that's our plans for the rest of our lines. And then let's see, we need to get into Elk Grove next. Uh, let's check our, did we build our fifth, fourth line out of here? We did not. So we've only got three. Yeah. So I'm going to actually start up here because I'm not exactly sure where our fourth line will be. Do I really need to do this right now? I don't. Um, let's see if we can get at least over into the Elk Grove area. And let's get going. This is going to give us some run out for our crossovers, which would be... I'm going to start right here. We got crossovers on the other side, correct? Correct. And let's throw our signal in here. Okay, now we need to get towards Elk Grove. So I'm going to use the inside track here. And we're going to keep her going. Where are we going to put that on? Where are we going to do this at Elk Grove at? If we get to the left side of the city... Actually, if we can bring it in right here, ooh, that would be a good idea. So we need to come up and around. Okay. So let's get that going. Up. Not like this. And then kind of like this. And how many are we going to have coming in here? Two cargo lines and a the high speed will go through. So we need a two passenger lines and the high speed will go through the middle because it won't be a stop at Elk Grove for it. Because it's a stop at Memphis. The next stop will be um, Corona, I think. Maybe. I don't know. But anyway, it's a, it's a pass through here. So I need to have 
two lines coming in, so I need one to pass through in a fourth. Okay. Let's build our building, and this time we're going, well, we can still do this. Yeah, it's going to have a nice riverside view here. And then we need a pass-through track for a high-speed line. And then we need one for our passenger platform. And we need a an underground here. And then we need another track for cargo. <clears throat> okay. Actually, ooh. You know what? I got two coming in. <clears throat> Yeah, we definitely need We definitely need another track. Cuz I have two coming in and one going out. <clears throat> And the reason I'm building that now is because I want to connect the this to here. So if I did, uh, it, it's going to cross over either way, so I guess it doesn't matter. And we can delete this track. Actually, no, that isn't even the one we wanted. We want this track to come out. Because that's a high speed line. And this guy actually can be deleted. So then we want to put this. I'm going to try. We're just going to. That's the inside line. You know what? I didn't... I don't know. It doesn't matter, I guess. So... We're going to do this. And we're going to see how this looks. And that's probably not what we want to do. <clears throat> Bridge pillar collision. What if we bring it up? What if we what if we what if we bring it up? It's probably because this one is okay, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna do this. Also watching our date to make sure we don't get past where we want to be. And there's a fly buzzing around me in my office, which is annoying. That's basically what we want right there. All right. It's not what we wanted. <laughs> because that should have came into that right there. That's my bad. 
We're gonna make the use of it. We're gonna make we're gonna make use of it because it's already there. So we're gonna make we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna make use of it. See, it turned out fine. Auto save, you're the real hero. We're going to bring this to like right here. And then we're going to split it off to right there because that is just the pass through line. Correct? Actually, if we made this the high speed line, and oh, that's the pass through. So that has to be that one. So if I did, if we change this up a little bit. And we say one of these other lines. If we say this guy is the is that one, and then this guy is that one, and then down here we can say say we're like right here. It would be the opposite, right? So this guy would be coming back out, and he'd need to go this way. And I think this is how I do it. I don't remember. And like that. Sure. Yes. Signal. A uh, boo yeah. That's what we want. It'd be cool if I can get the towns to grow enough that we need multiple passenger stations. Because that would be amazing. We're still in 1913. Okay. So that is done. Um, we need to... We're going to actually destroy this road. Sorry. Sorry. All right. And we need this guy to come out here. Like that. And it's going to go... It's going to swing this way. So I'm going to try to swing it. I'll try to give it a 75. Kind of like that. And we will need, which one is it? That one goes this way. So let's try to get this over to here. I'm going to get this one. This direction. All right, so that's good. Um, and we need to have, where does that go? Over to Carlton. So I'm gonna bring this one out straight. Like this. <clears throat> so I'm gonna bring it 
We might have to... Okay, I think I'm going to have to do this. I'm thinking ahead here. Okay. Because I need to bring this guy straight out. This is our high speed line. So I need to bring it straight out. And this is our other passenger line. So I'm going to bring it straight out. I know we're going to have to cross over, so... So I think that's going to be a double bridge. And we're going to bring it to right here, so then we can at least build the bridge across. Memphis can come... It's going to be a little wonky. Wonky is a technical term here. So this guy needs to split over like right away. Because it has to come, it has to come this way. And it has to go this way. <clears throat> oh, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. cargo line, which is right here. Can I get this? I need to be on that side. Listen, the wonkiness is wonky, but I think this is going to be what we want to do here. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, so we'll be coming in this direction. So the cargo line is going to need to jump over onto the cargo. Actually... Cargo line is right here. So if he's coming in, he's going to stay on this line. The passenger line is right here. So if he's coming in, he needs to jump over to the passenger line. Correct. And if he's coming out, he needs to jump over to the outside line. Correct. So he's coming out, he needs to jump over to the outside line. He's coming in, he needs to jump over to the inside line, which is the passenger station. Roger, that's good. Signalize it. And then for over here, this is just sort of the norm, right? So if he's coming out, he stays on this line, the passenger, or the cargo line. But if he's coming out, this is this, so he needs to jump over to there. And then he's coming in for cargo, be right there. down here all right I think that is correct so then that would be
the Lafayette to Elk Grove to Toledo. So let's make a new line. And we're going to do... This guy over to this guy. And this is going to be... Do I have anything in Lafayette right now? Oh, it's just laugh. Lafayette to... How did I... Toledo... Lafayette to Toledo, pass, passenger, enter, city. So then we know that that goes to Lafayette to finish off. Okay. Now let's see if we can put a train on that. Trying. Carl's bed, and we're using the general, and three passenger wagons, wagons, buy that, can we put it on Lafayette to Toledo, we can, it'll eventually show up, all right, and then over here at Elk Grove, the last thing we need to do is we need to put in our uh, road, road connections, ROADs. I'm looking at all this stuff. And if I do anything over here, it's going to need... Well, I could put it right here. No, I can't. So it might need a bridge on that side if we do anything on that side. Yeah, I don't think I can build that across. Yeah, I didn't think so. So if we did this. What is the... Okay, definitely need one more on that. And that will be green. I just need honestly just need it so I can figure out where to put the next part of this so let's just put that right there So it does have to be four. All right, right there. Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't know that we're going to get it to the ground before. We'll just have to deal with whatever. I can always bring it. I can't even bring it this way. Like, I'd have to bring it through here and then around here because of all the crossovers. I might be able to get it through here. Let's see. Okay. I am probably okay with that. Hey, we're in 1915. Well, welcome to 1915. Let's uh, pause that. That's where we want to be. We may actually want to be in 1916. I uh, probably should have left that. We're going to leave it to right here because it just looks better, right? Right. Kind of like that. All right, so the final thing we need to do here is we need to put in our passenger stuff because we have zero on the passengers over here, right? Right. Um, so let's do that. Let's get our passenger stuff going. Bus stop. Okay, we'll say, I don't know, one like right here. Maybe one like right here, and then one right here, and maybe one right here. Okay, new line. And we're going to go from here to here to here to here to here to here. To here to here. Wish it would go all the way around, but it doesn't. So that's fine. It can do a flip around thing. So this will be L Grove Passenger Intra City. And we need to build a station thing I think we do two of them all right well there we go next stop out of here will be Carlton then Memphis so we're going to have to swing this over here to Memphis and then also Elk Grove to Lafayette, which will Lafayette to Huntsville to Victorville. So this one's going to come like whoop and into here or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out in the next episode. Well, thanks so much for coming. Thanks so much for hanging out. I appreciate you as always. And until next time here in the Cargo Hub, let's get a good look at our station. Take care.